my dad take out the windows and you have to take out every single one of these I think they're screws or something and I've never been out able to look out the window um, but we will when we get the new one um, and it's going to look really really nice Keep coming out so easy. I don't have to use this thing. I can pop them out. Oops. Okay. Okay, now we're popping out this monstrosity. Emma helped me for a while. It was a couple too tight for her to get, so Lynn's on her lunch break. Helping me out. I have to bring in the muscle. <laughs> of course. Okay, all the hardware's off. Take it off. We're gonna take it off. Get some air in there. Nice warm day. Get a breeze in there. How long do you think it's gonna take? To get this thing off? I don't know. Maybe 10 seconds, maybe uh, 10 minutes. Just depends on how much the glue's stuck on here. I'm gonna try to do it without breaking it. What, you're not going to help? It's amazing after 20 years, this thing still wants to spring back to flat. I don't like the shape of this. We're going to reshape this too. I think I'm going to even this bottom edge out, even off the deck here. And then, I'm not sure yet, I'll play with around with it, but first step is get this off here. Silicone, pretty amazing stuff. Really doesn't even need the hardware to hold this on. interesting with everything out. I kind of like it. At least we're getting a lot of airflow today. It is a warm Seattle day. This is rare. We're having a little heat wave. It's supposed to get billed to about 95 by Thursday. So this will be a good time to do this. Come here! Does it look weird? It's gonna be so nice when you put the new one in. Oh, you wanna be the first one to go through there? Yeah. Of course. Can I come in through here? Go in through that one. Huh? I bet you nobody's gone through those in 25 years. 
Never. Nobody's ever done it. I don't think. Maybe. Somebody would do that. Except for me. Maybe. Okay. Project today. All this old silicone around these old windows. I'm gonna scrape all this out. Then I'm gonna reshape this window bank. Ton of silicone. Ton of work. Let's see how this stuff comes off. I've already done two, so I know what I'm in for. This will probably be about, I would guess, six hours to get all this out of here. Just chisel away real lightly so you don't mar the surface. about two hours into this now today four or five hours to go and this is how I'm doing it silicone is pretty amazing stuff seals well I mean this stuff's 20 plus years old sitting on here windows never leaked once. Let's see why now. All this in there. Just kind of keep working it, working it, working it. What I do is I scrape it as clean as I can with a chisel. Without digging in to the surface. back and I use a 60 grit sandpaper to get the next little layer off. I try to do that without going through the paint but that'll scuff the surface enough when I ferret it gives it something to grab to. I need to make sure all the silicone is 100% off before I use the fairing compound. See, I've fared it down here. Here's the old non-skid. Here's a flat surface. So I need to fare all this up. Just a little at a time here. It's nice getting the right angle of the sun. Helps you look at what you're doing. interesting today. We've got the blue angels buzzing overhead. We have Sea Fair in Seattle this weekend. Blue Angels are in town. It's always impressive. It gives you chills when they go by. Got the kind of interesting weather though got wildfires. All the smoke is coming down from British Columbia and really affecting our area. Air quality is terrible today. But still got to keep up with my work. So here's my project for today. I've taken the window out, stripped all the oh, all the silicone off. Now I've reshaped the window. This is what I'm doing. I'm evening out the bottom so it's even off the back deck, or the bottom deck, sorry. And I'll get this cut today, this morning. 
Then I'll have to fill in the Nidacore with epoxy, sand, fair, and get this area ready for paint. So that's my day. Doesn't seem like much, but that's going to be, oh geez, all day, easily. back just the edge of the nidacore about down a half an inch then I just crush it and I'm aiming for like three eighths to half inch now I'll fill it with a fairing compound and sand it smooth and that'll give you a nice finished edge What you doing, Emma? Reading comprehension. You have to read it and like, answer questions about the story or whatever. Is it fun? Okay. Eat your lunch while you're doing that. So, uh, Emma's having a little lunch and doing her homework. She's doing the Lexia program. I am going to head out here and work in this blazing Seattle sun. Mm. What I'm doing today is now that I've reshaped the whole window here, I'm fairing it all out. Getting ready for paint. I'll have this done today. I'll paint down tomorrow morning and then I'll put a whole single coat over the whole thing. Then now it's good. So I've got a little ways to go, but it's getting there. Okay, I just primed the last bit. I'll be putting the top coat on here in a few minutes. Kind of another hazy, warm day, so it's perfect conditions for painting. Gives you goosebumps, doesn't it? No, it's like every year, it doesn't matter. I still love it. I know, it's crazy. 
Okay, back to work. Happy Seafair. I'll start painting. I know. So I'm going to go sneak up on Teal and see what he's up to. Looks like um, this is the last bit of paint um, that we're going to be doing that covers up all the old stuff. So exciting. Hi, Hen. What are you doing? It's getting there. It's getting there. So this is the first coat of everything. And then we'll do one more coat and then we'll tape off and do um, a non-skid coat and then we can put in the new windows and hatches and, and hatches lights. well yeah. lights are nice, I guess. it's like the hottest hottest couple weeks in washington to date and we have no windows so no air conditioning so no air conditioning it's okay it'll get us acclimated to uh tropical areas again yes it's actually been perfect weather for painting yeah thanks for watching this week's episode of onboard lifestyle if you liked it please give us a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to our channel come back next week where we continue working on the salon windows on sv basic it's a really big project see you then